Hello everyone. We can continue the problem session on two port networks. Next problem is fifth problem. Two networks are connected in cascaded manner uh, with usual notations. The equivalent uh, ABCD constants are obtained. Given that C is like that, the the value of Z2 is what? Now we have to calculate the value of Z2. So this is what we all know that v1 through this we are having i1 right this is what v2 through this we are having i2 clear then the current through this branch is nothing but what which is nothing but i1 plus i2 right therefore by using abcd parameter representation that is we all know that v1 which is equal to what a v2 plus e i2 like that i1 is equal to what c v2 minus d i2 sorry here we are having minus d minus right so from this and by inspection this v2 this v2 is nothing but what z2 into i1 plus i2 right z2 into i1 plus i2 that's it that is given c which is equal to what 0 0.025 at an angle 45 degrees when we are having c c c is equal to i1 by v2 when i2 is equal to 0 C is equals to I1 by I1 by V2 when I2 which is equals to 0. Right? When I2 is equals to 0, obviously V2 is equals to what? Z2 I1, right? At this condition. v2 is equal to z2 i1 only from this right clear therefore from this z2 is nothing but what v2 by i1 v2 by i1 only z2 is equal to what v2 by i1 which is equal to what c here i1 by v2 is nothing but c, v2 by i1 is nothing but what? 1 by c, which is equals to what? 1 by 0 0.025 at an angle 45 degrees, which is equals to what? We are having 40 at an angle minus 45 ohms. That's it. Very simple one. Option B is correct. Next problem, the two port network P is shown in figure as port 1 and 2 denoted by terminals a b and c d respectively it has an impedance matrix okay and a 1 ohm resistor is connected in series with the net series with the network at port 1 as shown in the figure the impedance matrix of the modified two port network see given is what you are having extra Right, this is the Z11, Z12, Z21, Z22. Right, these are the output ports. Given that the value of this external register is nothing but 1, and through this we are having I1, this is I2. Right, this is E1, this is V2. Right. See, is there any change in the value of uh, V2 because there is no external resistance across this V2, right? See, V1 which is equal to what? We all know that Z11 I1 plus Z12 I2 and V2 is equal to what? Z21 I1 plus Z22 I2. So, 
वोल्टेज ई टू does not get affected right therefore modified modified impedance matrix k is what simply z Mod per which is equals to we are having only we are having one ohm branch in series with Z. This is the only that's it. We are having Z one one plus one, Z one two, Z two one, Z two two. This is the modified Z matrix. That's it. So next is the Z parameters of the two port network shown in the figure like that. and he provided that the load across port to he wants the average power delivered through that rn so from this we can write through input port given that this is z right we all know that v1 which is equal to given that 40 i1 z11 Like that we are having sixty I two. Like that V two is equals to what? I T I one plus hundred I two. That's it. So by inspection, we can say that see, this V two is nothing but what? This V two given that R L equals to what? Twenty ohm. See the current direction. This is like this. But see the potential of V two is nothing but plus minus. Obviously. V two is equals to what? The inspection V two is equals to what? Minus twenty I two. That's it. Okay. Therefore, substitute this into this. We are having minus twenty I two plus I T I one plus hundred I two. From this, we are having I two is equals to what? Minus two by three I one. Okay, two by three I one clear, and then I two we have to substitute into this equation. Therefore, V one which is equal to what forty I one plus sixty into minus two by three I one which is equals to what forty I one plus here also we can, we are having what forty I one V one which is equal to zero volts. Therefore. A inspection twenty, which is equal to ten i one plus v one. This is from input loop, right? So v one is zero. Therefore, i one is what we are having. I one is two amps. So we are having I one. Obviously, I two should be equal to what? Minus two by three into I one minus four by three amps. That's it. We are having I one and I two. That's it. Therefore, power through R L, which is equal to what? I square. The current through this port is nothing but I two only. I two square into R L. Therefore, power through R L, which is I two, is what? Minus four by three. That is minus four by three whole square into R L is what? Twenty. So, which is equal to sixteen by nine into twenty. Obviously, we will get thirty-five point three five watts. The answer is what? Thirty-five point three five watts. Next question is. The currents I one, I two at input and output port respectively of a two-port network can be expressed as. So see, this is the representation of what y, right? I one, I two. Obviously, we will get the equivalent pi network with respect to y parameter representation. Therefore, we can summarize.
like this we are have right looks like pi okay that's it this is by a pi b pi c plus minus this is v1 to this i1 like that to this i2 plus minus v2 that's it now here i am providing the generalized analysis to get y11 y12 y21 y22 okay so given that y11 is nothing but pi y pi and y12 is nothing but minus 1 y21 is also minus 1 y22 is nothing but 1 right that's it now case if let us say this is this is a this is b kcl at a therefore i1 let us say this is i1 this is what i3 this is i4 okay therefore i1 which is equals to and this is i5 i3 plus i4 from this i1 is what i3 is what v into y that's it v1 into y a see i3 is what v1 across we are having v1 into the admittance in the branch is nothing but y a therefore like that i4 is what i4 is through what v1 minus v2 right into yb right so from this i1 which is equals to v1 into ya plus yb plus minus yb into v2 so this is at node a right next at node b at node b what we are having i2 which is entering is i2 leaving is what enter i2 plus i4 is equals to i5 therefore i2 is equals to what i5 minus i4 at 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 b i2 which is equals to i5 minus i4 from um, this i2 what is the value of i5 through this yc i4 is what vb minus va right this is only through v2 yc minus vb is what v1 minus v2 into yb therefore from this i2 which is equals to what minus yb into v1 plus yb plus yc into v2 right this is i2 so from 1 and 2 therefore y11 is nothing but what ya plus yb like that y12 which is nothing but what minus yb y21 which is equals to what minus yb y22 which is nothing but what yb plus yc that's it right given that y11 y12 y21 y22 right this is what given that this is 5 this is what 1 this is 1 this is what this is yeah 1 only sorry this is minus 1 minus 1 right this is 1 from this y11 is 5 and y1 yc is what So y22 is given as 1, we all know that yc is what? yc. y3 which is equals to what is y3? He wants the equivalent 
pi network so y a y b y c we have to calculate right so y b is what 1 y 1 1 from 1 this is 2 from 1 pi which is equals to y b is nothing but 1 therefore y a plus 1 y a which is equals to what 4 right updated from 2 y 2 to 1 pi b is nothing but 1 plus y c y c which is equals to what 0 most completed what about y b y b is nothing but 1 therefore the equivalent pi network is nothing but what this is the equivalent pi network in that this is what y a which is equals to what 4 this is y b which is equals to 1 this is y which is equals to 0 that's it this is the answer next last one find the open circuit parameter of the two port network shown in figure simple no we have two loops this is i1 this is i2 we can apply z parameter representation here i am providing a simple shortcut shortcut you all know that v1 which is equal to z11 i1 plus z12 i2 like that v2 which is equal to what z21 i1 plus z22 i2 right we can have kvl right from this by applying kvl we will have i1 and i2 right then z matrix so this is the z matrix therefore here z11 is nothing but self impedance z12 is nothing but mutual impedance like that z21 is nothing but which is also mutual impedance as z22 this is self impedance so to calculate z11 let us say this is z1 z2 z3 now this is z1 plus z2 only the impedance in loop 1 this is what only we are having z2 this is what z2 this is what only the impedance which is present in loop 2 that's it this is the shortcut therefore z matrix which is equals to what z11 is nothing but what see j40 minus j160 what we are having minus j120 like that z2 is nothing but what z12 or z21 minus j160 that is minus j160 this is what minus j160 plus j80 that is minus j80 that's it this is the open circuit parameters from this circuit this is the shortcut if you have any doubt go through the conventional method that's it that is open circuit output port case one like that open circuit input port we will get z11 z12 z21 z22 so by default this is the shortcut for this method that's all for problems based on two port networks